guys, I'm Shakha and welcome to Beat Down Style Under 3. Today we're breaking down a look of Kareena Kapoor Khan who was spotted in a really relaxed and easy look at the airport. She was seen wearing an oversized jumper that had typography on it. The jumper was from Wild Fox Couture. She paired it with a pair of mom jeans that had an elastic band on the hem. Uh, she styled the look with a pair of brown flat pointed toe mules and she wore a silver watch along with a couple of uh, really colourful bracelets to add a pop of colour to the look. She finished the look with my favourite part, a pair of really cool vintage looking tiny sunglasses and a tote bag. I think she looks really chic and it's such an easy look to recreate. So we've picked out a couple of pieces to help you guys recreate her look. The first one that I have over here is a white oversized jumper. It says sail me away. I think it's perfect for a vacation. What I'd suggest you guys can pair it with is a pair of really relaxed jeans like this one. This black pair of jeans has a, not a skinny fit but a wider hem. Um, it also has a frayed hem as you can see so it gives it that really breezy vibe. So just pair this jumper with a pair of jeans like this one and a pair of flats like the one Karina was wearing. Tiny vintage sunglasses and your travel tote and you'll have yourself look like a celebrity. The next one that I have over here is this oversized hoodie. I think hoodies look really cool. It's an oversized size loose fit and I think what would look really cool underneath this is a pair of distressed shorts like these ones um, so they'll just be peeking through a little bit it'll be a really chic and cool look um, I'd suggest skip the flats that Karina was wearing for this one and go for a pair of chunky sneakers they give you a really nice height and you can always pair it with the tote that she was wearing as well as the tiny sunglasses that she wore the last one is a really simple look over here. Um, these are a pair of jeans that have a very slight distress to them. They're a really easy fit. Um, what you can pair them with is again an oversized hoodie. So over here we have this really long and oversized hoodie and the reason why this is long is again because this is from the men's section. So I think it makes for a really cool look with a pair of skinny jeans like this one that has a bit of a distress to it. Um, it would work well with a pair of flats that Karina was wearing but I think again a pair of white sneakers would give, give it a very sporty street chic vibe and you'd be comfortable as well. You could maybe skip the tote and go for a backpack instead but the jumper that Karina was wearing again was really long like this one so I think this is a perfect fit to take inspiration from her. So as you guys can see it's not too hard to recreate your favorite celebrities looks just break it down and pick up pieces from here and there and you'll have yourself a fabulous look like Karina's. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Today we're talking about an airport look of Kareena Kapoor Khan who looks fabulous as always as she walked out of the airport with her son who's the apple of the internet's eye, Taimur Ali Khan. Speaking of Taimur's outfit, he looked super cute. He was wearing this jumper that said, I love my mom and he paired it with a pair of jeans and he styled it with riding boots. Very Patodi and Nawabi of him to do that. But we're talking about Kareena's outfit today. Kareena was seen wearing a pair of navy blue skinny jeans which she styled with a white t-shirt. She layered the look with a army green bomber jacket that she wore zipped up and further styled the look with brown knee-high boots. I think Karina looked great as always. She had her pout in place, she had her big sunglasses to avoid the paparazzi and the outfit is so simple yet so chic. Um, with moms on the go, I feel like athleisure is the biggest blessing for them because um, you can just throw on a pair of jeans and a bomber jacket over a t-shirt and still look stylish because that's what the trend is currently. So you don't have to invest too much or put too much thought into your look and um, you can just have a look like Karina's on the go. So a couple of pieces we've picked out over here to show you guys the look. I did feel like the army green and the brown boots did not go too well together. I wish she would have picked either a brown suede or brown uh, bomber jacket or she should have worn a pair of black knee-high boots instead. So um, keeping the theme of brown in mind, we have over here a pair of skinny jeans and then what you could style it with is of course a white t-shirt on the inside and then layer it with a brown suede bomber jacket like this one. Um, like Kareena Kapoor Khan, you could either leave it loose or you could zip it halfway up and let the white t-shirt peek through to add a little bit of contrast. Wear it with a pair of brown boots since it's winter season so you can have fun with your footwear and you'll have yourself a fabulous outfit like hers.
if you feel like bomber jackets are a bit too young or too athletic risk for your style another alternative for you guys to just throw on and look super chic is a duster jacket um this one is in a similar color to that of the bomber jacket of kareena kapoor khan it's long lines so it also cuts you off from the sides if you're conscious of wearing skinny jeans and uh, thigh high boots then i think pairing the entire ensemble with a duster jacket that's really long works completely well so you could wear a white t-shirt on the inside just throw this duster jacket on you could either tie it around the waist or just leave it loose leave it flying like a cape for the super mom that everyone is so that's all we have from this episode of Beat Down Style. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Today we're talking about a look of Kareena Kapoor Khan. For a recent reality show that Kareena was judging, she's done a lot of power dressing. She was seen wearing a purple pantsuit which had cutouts around the waist. It was really sexy. And in a more recent appearance, she was seen wearing an all black look where she wore a pair of high-waisted wide leg black trousers that she paired with a long line blazer which was double breasted. Um it had a power shoulder on one side, so it had shoulder padding on one side and it was sleeveless from the other side. So that kind of balanced it out and made it a little bit more sexy and glamorous uh, for the styling she kept it super minimal she skipped accessories altogether and she wore a very fresh face of makeup for her footwear she was seen wearing a pair of black close toe heels a pair of black high waisted wide leg trousers is i think a must have in every girl's wardrobe but there's a big misconception attached to it so people think that if you have a uh, shorter legs or if you're shorter you can't wear high waisted or wide leg trousers but on the contrary it's something that you can really use to your advantage just as Karina did in her look um what you can do is instead of getting the pants hemmed according to your height you could create this tilt effect so basically uh when you go for those circuses and stuff like that when you see those super tall people they wear wide leg pants and they have the a uh, wooden leg underneath it and they wear a close toe shoe with that so what happens is that the pant completely covers the wooden leg and you could do exactly that with yourself by wearing a pair of close toe heels with your look i'm going to show you a look and give you an example to better understand it so over here we have a pair of wide leg pants as you can see they're high waisted and they're wide leg now if these cover your toes and you feel like would be a disruption in walking pair them with the highest heel that you have and your legs will look super long so i have a pair of heels over here to show you guys as you can see these boots have a decent heel i'd suggest if you can go for a taller heel if you're short and you want to look really tall go for the tallest heel that you can find pair your pants with a pair of boots like these these are close toes so it creates an elongated effect to your legs and your legs will look really really tall again since it's a high waist so it will again extend your uh, length upwards as well and if you pair it with a matching blazer then you'll have yourself a look just like Karina's you could pick a blazer like this one This blazer over here has a wrap style detail so it looks really cool. Um it has a little bit of a belt inside. So what you could do is you could skip wearing a bustier or a shirt or a top on the inside and just pair a wrap style blazer like this one with a pair of trousers. The other one is a really classic example. I think you could pair a black tank top or a black bustier and then just layer it with a blazer like this one which has a lapel collar detail like this. So it looks really casual, it looks really breezy and with those shoes you'll really have yourself a powerful look. So by just trying a couple of combinations like these and wearing really high close to heels under your pants, you can have yourself a look like Kareena Kapoor Khan and look like a million bucks just as she did. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Today we're breaking down a look of Kareena Kapoor Khan who showed us that the print camo need not necessarily only be worn when you're going for a utilitarian look or a grunge look or an athleisure look it can also look really chic and stylish uh, and polished so let's break Kareena's look down she was seen wearing a crisp oversized white shirt that she wore with a pair of camo printed pants uh, the pants were not a skinny fit or a loose fit they weren't a baggy fit they were just the right fit um, they almost fit like a pair of 
of trousers. She further styled the look with a pair of army green pointed toe heels. She kept a fresh face of makeup, pulled all her hair behind, wore a bright lip like she usually does and wore big sunglasses to complete the look. She also carried a polished bag that I think added a touch of elegance to this look. So today I'm going to show you guys how you can pick up the camo print pieces that you have at home or if it's a print that you're looking to invest in but your style is more elegant and polished then here's how you can wear camo. First up, you can try skipping a pair of pants and wear a camo skirt instead. Um, this is not a skater skirt or a loose skirt or a mini skirt. It's a fitted pencil skirt. So it looks really elegant. It looks really polished because pencil skirts always do look polished. And you could pair something like this with an oversized white shirt like this. Now what you could do is either, uh, you know, just tuck the shirt into the skirt like so or you could leave it loose outside or wear it in a French tuck and then you could wear a pair of pointed toe heels in a army green colour the way Karina did. A red lip would make it look even more polished and elegant and keep your hair sleek and classy with a look like this one. The other way that you could do is to pick a pair of well-fitted camo printed pants the way Karina was wearing and then pick a nice oversized shirt that has another print on it. So it looks stylish, it looks chic, the top looks more feminine like this one over here has a floral embroidery on it so it looks really feminine and chic while the camo printed pants uh, add a bit of grunge to it and also add another print to the look and also a burst of colour into the look. Just make sure that your pants fit you well. Don't go for a baggy fit because then it may look a bit more laid back and what we're trying to achieve is a polished look like Karina's. That's all from this episode of Beatdown Style Under 3. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. For more fashion tips, subscribe to channel and press the bell icon.